So for making this type of aura, first you have to import a background over here. You can see I have imported a background, then add an overlay or a green screen animation just like this, then remove its green screen animation by using the Chrome key or remove background. And then what you have to do, you have to adjust your character at the center like this or the place where you want your character to be. Then make a duplicate copy of it, like check it one or two times, then make a duplicate copy of it and drag it downside just like this. Then you have to give it some custom uh, CCs, like color correction. It depends on you. So the reason behind giving this uh, CC is to give the character a little bit more glow and a better look. Then we'll go to the video effects and we'll search the solution effect, add the solution effect like this, then go and set the object of this to the overlay. Uh, set the object of this to overlay, then go into the adjustment and in the adjustment set the speed to 5 or 6 and glow to 100, size to 0 and the intensity will be 0. Okay, just like this, then make a duplicate copy of the solution effect, then you have to go into the overlay, click on this overlay, go into the adjustment and you have to give it the color that you want. I want it to be white because I will change the color of it by using the effect. If you want another color, you can use that, then go into the video effects. And in the video effects, go and search water ripple effect and add that effect like this. Then change the object of this to the overlay and go into the adjustment, set the vertical to 100, speed to 100 and this one to 0, size to 0 and twist to 100, just like this. So we can get the different type of aura that we want. Now I'm adding the color by using the JVC effect. Uh, over here, I'm setting the object of this to the overlay, setting the color to 100, intensity to 100, and also glow to 100 to get the pinkish color of the aura. And may, I made two copies of it, but I, I need a little bit more glow, so I will add glow to. Make sure to add glow to in your uh, effects and change the object of this to the character that you have over here. And over here, your aura is almost completed. But if you want it to be a little bit more uh, like upscaled, you can go into the overlay and increase the scale of that overlay. And after that, uh, you will get your aura a little bit more bigger than your character. And there you go, your new type of aura is completed. And I hope you guys will try these type of aura in your edits. Till then, we'll meet in the next video and peace out.